hearts and paper flowers. Right. Let's go with the hair. Now, I didn't cut out the hair earlier because I wanted to show you probably the best way to cut hair. I thought you were going to say your mag cutting skills. No. Maybe. But, um, yeah, pretty, because his hair is really, really, really curly. Feminine sigh heart. So it's kind of really hard to cut out. Can you see what I'm doing? Mm -hmm. Uh, that a black pieces on that is the phone that I made with Nuri. You don't have to. It's just a little extra thing. This is one way to do it. Um, so yes, slowly and turn the paper instead of the scissors. One of my favorite way to do it. Do it. Does it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Isn't um, Maceo from Persona 1 has a uh, button yeah, or it, a it, pin it, that says it, it's, a, it. it's a pin. Although it's weird that I've been, I heard them called buttons. I heard them called buttons too. I always get confused when they do call them buttons, but it's a pin. That says do it. Okay, it's not going to... Continue cutting that way because I want to see you know where you're cutting. Okay, so I didn't bother going around the inside, and now it's it's supposed to be loose, and then pop. And then it doesn't have to be like a long strip. So it's probably easier to do it that way. Um, I can't remember. Some patterns, like uh, the hair may be a bit too long. You can snip it very similar when it's on the head. Uh, to... The way I said you a minute ago, I just like doing the really long interny turny stuff. Wow, this must be really boring. I'm sorry. Um Well that and also doing the like just the long turny strips is, mm. you know that is tedious to clean up later though. Mm. We said it's easier. So Um, darn it, I had a point. <laughs> oh, yes, because I didn't notice. Uh, cut this away. Oh, like that, so that tab is free. Anyway, that's the example. I'm going to cut the rest out off camera because this is game boring. <laughs> Yeah, I'm um, sorry. I did have a point. What I was going to say is um, the snip, snip, pluck. 
uh, method is uh, useful for um, when you have to trim it directly on the head. Like, for instance, a dotty over to the side of me. His hair was too long because Adati's hair is actually relatively um, shortcut when I did it. So I had to trim it when it was on him. And you can do that um, method much easier if you need to trim when not on them. Um, I do think phi, um, you have to trim it. So it, you may have to. Unless you you decided. Unless you do prefer it that way. You can have a slightly longer hair. Um, a dotsy or phi or whatever. You probably, like, if you have a, I don't know, fam, how do you call alternate fiscal character? What would you have words for that? I mean, what would you have words for <laughs> what is it? Yeah, yeah. Um, 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 yeah, well, I don't know what you would call that, but if you prefer to, like, have that character with longer hair. Or, like, if you did main character from some game because it's your version of that character. It's a silent hero. If you don't adapt it a little bit, it's not so fun sometimes. That's what I think, anyway. Hence why we had to change names in Nocturne. Yes. What? We mentioned the... Um... Oh, yeah, we seen... Yeah, and Nocturne because it was our first S&T title. Um... We changed everyone's names because we're like, well, I'm never going to remember all these characters, no offense, Japanese names. We played it quite some time ago. Um, and, you know, it's like, I'm not going to connect with them. Especially since in Nocturne, you don't see them very often, do you? No. Anyway, so we changed um, everyone's name to something we recognize more. And also... That really helped the plot because it made us connect with them because we named, we named them to something we did relate to. So we're like, you know... Um, we're more of kind of... Invested. Yeah, invested. Um, so any game that's, you know, like that S&T series, I play must always change the main character a little bit to become more invested. And that way I can participate in the journey more. Figuring out who my character is, not just figuring out what else is going on around it. Because sometimes you don't get a lot of plot in some of the more traditional games. I mean, Reddit Cruise, you know how you get a ton of it. Persona, you definitely get some, not necessarily for the main character, though. I'm not including Persona 2. Yeah, because Persona 2 kind of breaks the rules on that in general. No, it doesn't break the rules. It just bends them. So they scream for mercy. <laughs> No, it bends them until it says, okay, um, I have to put the universe back to the way it was. Oh. And then Tetsu's like, I don't think so. Yeah. Oh, Tetsu didn't mean to. Oh, he, oh. It's debatable. Yeah, uh, spoilers. <laughs> right, so... Changing names happens. Cools. It's all right. Uh, investment. Oh, um, if I could change Narumi's name, I wouldn't change Narumi's name. I love Narumi. I can't think of anything besides that. Oh, little thing for Narumi's pattern. Could you zoom on the head? Uh, you know what? You have. Yes, so you can see it. As you can see, I have changed Narumi's eye color. Um, otherwise he would be a so. Nah. Well, I'm boring. Well, I like adding color. Like, um, I add color to his tie, too, because his tie is black. I made it a purplish color, actually. So, you know, adding a little bit of color to things. Um, same ref I think my write-up pattern is standard black and white. It's standard black and white. I can verify for you. Oh boy, this is a lot of curves. Uh, take your time cutting hair. I'll let this video down because it's gotta be boring as hell. 